So, okay, everyone, sorry. I, I think I hit a button and shut off the recording for Jaden, but this is his Black Knight. Um, as you can see, it's kind of like a boot right here. Kind of his leg going up. And I'm going to start making part of the body. Since it's our first time on YouTube, we might get a little comments, but I don't know how much we'll get. But I'm more worried about people watching and painting. Well, it, since it is our first time on YouTube, Jaden, probably people doesn't don't know to pay attention, but um, hopefully they will see your art and comment about how brave you are. You're 10 years old. You're on YouTube. You're painting, a, for the first time, a black knight, right? Yes. Have you ever painted on a canvas like this before? No. No. So this is your first canvas painting? Yes. And you're on YouTube. Yes. I must say, impressive. So, I'm going to just scoot in just a little close. Jaden, again, YouTubers, this is, this really just came about a few moments ago. Jaden just got to our house less than an hour ago and informed me that he wanted to paint. And since I remembered he wanted to be a YouTuber, I said, let's go online. So, the... The lighting is a little off. It's not bright as it should be. His painting probably isn't coming through as good as it could be, but we can, uh, at least we're having a good time, spending some family time together, which is the most important part. Now your knight's gonna be holding a sword, right? Yes. This hand, uh is not going to be, it's just by him. And, okay. So his sword is gonna be kinda going up, so I'm gonna make his arm go up. All right, so for the rock, what I, um, I'm probably gonna use that for like the sword blade. And, you already know how it's gonna turn out. It was very Now, swash that, get this again. There we go. Okay, get that back. It might be a little drippy. And I'm gonna use a certain color. Okay. You can, so. Remember, you can wipe it on that towel and live under no guilt if you want to. Try the brush down a little now, bit. Now, um, let me think what I'm going to use. I'm going to use this color. And what color is that? Oh, it's a new color. Oh, it's a metallic? <clears throat> yes, metallic. And I will be right back so I can go open this. So here is his little piece of art so far. Did you get some help? I opened it on my own. Very nice. Now that is a yeah, metallic. It may come out smoother. I mean, I'll show you why I'm gonna use it. Okay, so tell your audience why you're what you're doing and why. I'm so if you know on a sword, kind of how it has that kind of cross part right there. That's kind of what I'm doing. Like the, where he holds it, like the basket part? Yes. Now his hand, you won't see really, but I'll try to fit it in. 
This blade. So now I'm gonna put this up. Use a new color. And I'm probably going to probably use this color. I mean that brush. And tell this color. <laughs> Maddie. Maddie. Madison. We're live on YouTube. I just mindful. <clears throat> I'm making a feather like that to have on me. That's interesting. Okay, let's get back to. So the way you hold your brush, Chayden, is very interesting. Where did you learn this technique? Um, I just like, um, I don't really know. I'm just doing it. It's just what feels natural to you? Yeah. Kind of want to get some black in there, too. So it kind of looks more 3D. Mm -hmm. and, um, so maybe after it dries a little, yeah. we can go back on. Now I'm going to put red in it. So I might um, probably get a little red in the tip and some black. So it still kind of looks good like that, like dark red. Mm -hmm. Just give him a little definition. And yes, I am going to go back to this and paint back over it. And just probably see kind of why. And then, so it's. So you're given that rock definition and yeah. some depth.
So Chaden is my grandson. He's my oldest grandson. He's 10 years old. He lives in South Carolina. And he has come up this weekend for a visit to the mountains of North Carolina. And he is one of three of my grandsons. And as you can hear in the background, the newest grandson, Mason, is um, two months old. And... Um, very aware that he's awake at the moment, so he, he's saying his words, but he's very precious. So we're watching Chayden paint a rock and a knight on his rock. And this is his first YouTube Live and his first acrylic painting. So we're very excited. I'm very proud of this artist that we have in the home. So we may do a couple of YouTubes throughout the weekend because I'm sure this painting will progress. It has to dry and he fills in more colors and stuff to give it more depth. So, um... Okay, so now we're going to put that up. Um, now I'll tell you what I'm making next. Um, it's kind of like lightning for like this like cool and stuff. And I'm going to mix this up with this. So you're putting a gold in your metallic. Yes. And I think it might turn out pretty And make it light. Yes. I realize this to me. What? Pepper Jack cheese. It's okay. Yeah. That'd be good. So we got lightning going on. And I wish I had a little bit better view and I'm putting shadows in and I'm sorry. Again, so sorry. I do know what kind of lighting you really do need for YouTube. I just got online with my grandson with excitement. Who wants to be a YouTuber. More for games and probably less for painting. But I have to say he's doing a pretty good job. So this is your lightning that's coming down. Are you sticking it in the oven? Okay. That'll be fine. The master at work. I see the night coming to form. It is the black night. Don't you love his lightning? Holding Excalibur in his hand. The artist is fine tuning the helmet. This is Watch the brush strokes as he slowly puts it together. The masterpiece is underway. I like that where the lightning's maybe catching his boot. It's kind of actually some yellow I'm going to put in his shoes for shine. Put some black, making it. Yeah. Now I'm going to put that up. See, there's my red. 
what's going on with that. Yeah, mix it up a little bit in there. Hope it's not so drippy. Look how he's holding his brush, just ever so loosely. Not gripping it, not clenching it. What would you say to other kids your age or just kids in general who would like to maybe paint or even go online and do YouTube videos? What would you say to them, Jaden? I would say, um, well, if you're kind of painting or doing any of that, I would just take your time. Don't rush the video. And try to be as brave as you can because you can do it. That's what I was trying to say. And as you can see, I got this going on. And now I, I was thinking of this now. Um, so we're going to use some brown. And it's actually going to be something where like some dark and broken trees are. Something's living in it or something like that. Ooh, I like the trees. This all wacky everywhere, all trees, craziness. And then you take your time and make little things. That's what makes it really good. Now, I would say if you're like kind of trying to like paint the same thing as I'm doing, um. Just take your time like I'm doing, don't rush it, and kind of do like loosely like I'm kind of doing. And if you do it a little harder, it won't turn out as good, but it's really nice. And just have fun too, right, Che? Yeah. Just enjoy the process. And here is a tree, and I'm going to make another one. So I'm going to kind of put the trees kind of together. I picked this brush because it actually turns out pretty good. And this time I'm not going to have a hole in this one, but it is kind of going to be like broken around these spots. Um, as you can see, that one's kind of broken. smooth day I did it because it looks good that way. Alright, now I'm going to make a fallen tree over here. But I'm 
so I'm gonna make half of it kind of onto the giant rock here. Now the reason why the knight um would be bigger than the trees is because he's pretty tall. So it says. So when you started this project, this paint project, Jaden, what all did you have in mind in the beginning? Well, I kind of thought it would kind of be like um, standing up with a sword in the air, but then like that, except kind of that way. But instead, I kind of thought this, because as you go along, you think more thoughts. You do, don't you? You become more creative. Yeah. So did you think about trees and lightning, or did you just think about initially the idea of the, bl the Black Knight? The Black Knight. That was your first initial thought. Yeah. So all of this has been coming about as you have been painting. Yeah. So your creativity is just blooming as you go along. As you can see the trees falling right here, some parts. See it's not all the way it's topped. And it's just broken up. Um now I'm gonna make really dark grass since it's kind of lightning and all that stuff. Um maybe think so I might wanna use some green. I have a really pretty dark color. And maybe I was thinking about putting kind of this over it. Let's see how that turns out, all that jelliness. Yeah. <clears throat> um, and if it's not dark enough, Chayden, I've got a um, paint that's gorgeous. Here we go. It's actually turning out kind of very good. That's kind of what I want. Not too dark, not too light, just perfect. Alright, so you want to turn it not. the other side which won't turn out as good because the tree, that tree is kind of broken up and that's kind of wet or paint so I'm gonna kind of, kind of see if I can get as much on there as possible there you go then you can like make swirls That's a good idea. And kind of like little barn things growing on in there. A little bit more. Okay. Let's see if you can see. It will dry up pretty easily. It's kind of like my lightning, except kind of blind. I'm going to make it more goofy. And the moss.
again we are a family and we haven't seen each other for a while and now what i just came up with is kind of moss and vine on each other doing great so all the background noise i do apologize there's dinner being made in the background family talking dogs barking and Chayden and I are in here doing a YouTube video. Exactly. Being artistic. But I will say, Chayden, um, I'm about to run out of battery. Okay. So when we and get to a good I'm stopping... I'm going to show you one more thing before we have to stop this channel. We'll probably come back and do some more if Chayden's got some more work to do. I just got to make some black sky, and then I'm finished. So you kind of want to sweat, sweater, crop, make a lot of black in there. Lots. And then, kind of pink, over... And I might actually use this because that seems like I can get something done really quick and easy. See, it kind of gives more off. And then we'll come back and let that char the phone charge up, and then we'll come back and see how it turns out. I like that idea. Just kind of connecting to the lightning. Oh, that is an angry sky. Love it. Okay guys, so we'll come back after this tries and we'll see how it goes. So bye for now. Bye.